So way to omnes. Welcome to this introductory lesson on Familia Romana. So we're looking at a map here, a map of the Roman Empire. Uh, and I'm going to just point out some of the, the terms and the places. Imperium Romanum means Roman Empire. Imperium, in addition to meaning empire, can mean power or command or something like that. Um, but Imperium Romanum here is in reference to the, the Roman Empire. The kind of darker green in the middle is the Roman Empire. The lighter green on the outside would be areas outside the empire. So I'm going to go through some of the places starting in the upper left. Britannia, Britain. Um, then moving down you can see the Oceanus Atlanticus, the Atlantic Ocean. Usually they just call that Oceanus, okay? And then Hispania is Spain. Gallia is Gaul, which would be modern France and Belgium. The Reynus River is the Rhine River. Um, to the east of the Reynus is Germania, Germany. Uh, that was outside the Roman Empire. The Romans conquered small parts of that region, but they never really held on to it much. So. For most of the time, the Reynus, the Rhine, and the Danubius, which is the Danube, uh, were borders um, at the edge of the empire. Europa is Europe, named after a heroine from Greek mythology named Europa. Now, if we move down um, into Italy, uh, Italy is Italia. Roma, Rome, is the capital on the Tiberis River. Uh, Tiberis in English is the Tiber. Tusculum is a small town near Roma. And then further down Italy, you see sort of towards the heel of the boot of Italy, Brundisium. Uh, that's the modern town of Brindisi. It was a port town. They could sail from Italy to Greece and back and forth. And the kind of triangle ball that the boot of Italy kicks is Sicilia, Sicily. Um, below that is Milita, Malta. Over to the west of Italy, you see Corsica and Sardinia, Corsica and Sardinia. And if we look east of Italy, we find Graecia, Greece. In Greece, we have Delphi, uh, Delphi. We have Sparta. Sparta. You see the island of Euboea, Euboea. And in the Aegean Sea, which is the sea between Greece and modern-day uh, Turkey, uh, which the Greeks and Romans called Asia or Asia Minor, in between Greece and, and Turkey, you see a variety of islands, starting from the north, Lemnos, and then Lesbos, and then Chios, Samos, Naxos, Rhodos, and then down um, most south of there is Creta, Crete. Now if we look a little further um, to the east, we see Asia, and in Asia, uh, which again, that's where we get Asia from, um, and there's Part of that was called Asia Minor, the part that sticks out that's um, modern day Turkey. But south of where you see Asia marked, there's Syria, Syria. Uh, further south is Arabia, Arabia. And then Aegyptus, Egypt. And in Egypt, you have the Nilus River, the Nile River. And then you can see all of North Africa. Africa. Africa could be in reference to the continent or more specifically just to what we would call North Africa along the coast, which was part of the Roman Empire. Um, the Romans never really went past the Sahara, um, you know, into the more southern parts of Africa. All right, well, there's a good introduction to some Roman imperial geography. Hope it helped you out.